It was uh, certainly a different debate in tenor, tone, just from the start tonight uh, than we saw in Atlanta just a few months ago. There was so much expectations coming to this as the race had narrowed in the last few days. First debate for Kamala Harris where seasoned uh, uh, Donald Trump has had seven contrasting styles and backgrounds and kind of philosophies in the debate. So it was a real clash of uh, differences between the two. Kamala Harris came in with a bunch of a uh, great degree of difficulties that she had to achieve tonight. Um, she's not as defined of uh, voters, a good chunk want to know more about her. Given that she had such a tall task and the stakes were so high, I thought she performed very admirably with uh, against a very formidable opponent and so much scrutiny you know, on this, this race. So she delivered one of her, her best debates. She was generally on the offense against Donald Trump, um, touting her experience as vice president, uh, having a clear vision for where she wanted to lead the country, and was just from the opening moments of the debate, um, really uh, going toe to toe, showing that she had the presidential gravitas that's required for such a position. Um, and I thought she uh, accorded herself pretty well. Yeah, Donald Trump, I'd say, had a, an inconsistent performance, certainly not as well as he did in Atlanta. Um, he, you know, he knocked out uh, the sitting president um, and not having him seek re-election. So it was a high bar for him to achieve such success. Um, as the debate progressed, he just got a little bit less disciplined, and you could tell um, that Kamala Harris achieved her goal of getting under his skin, and I think took him off his little, his best debate game tonight. Clearly, both of them have the target audience of independent swing voters in a handful of battleground states. I don't know that any of them really uh, sold the deal or finished that tonight. Uh, it's, it's hard in 90 minutes to have people that are kind of low information voters, very casual, don't see her all the time, to make a, a formal decision. If anything, maybe in the coming days, you'll see some slight gains by Harris in that department because she probably had the better overall uh, performance. Um, but there's this very small swath of voters. There's not many of them, but the elections have been so close in the last two years and may even be closer this time that even if you affect uh, thousands of them, tens of thousands, that could be enough to swing a very close election.